morning, morning. Well, I guess you say afternoon. So it's like 11 ish. Like, but oh my goodness. It's, I just can't believe they want to play me like this. The freaking gas company. And then I hear some rain going on. My doors. I said I was going to call and be a little cray cray with them, but I'm not even going to bother with it, which I didn't. But I did call because he just bought his little fine ass over here, whoever he is, and cut the gas off. So I called to see if he could bring his butt back and turn it back on. No, you have to pay an extra $40. I'm not paying no extra $40. I forgot, though. I forgot. I forgot about the gas bill. But I done paid it. This is my situation going on right now, though. I didn't know it was supposed to rain today. So, I don't know about me being too, too great today. You know. So, I'm not going to worry about being all fancy antsy or nothing. See, I done throw, I done, I washed my hair. And everything. I don't put this on it. That uh, it's raining outside. Why it's dark? I'm sitting in my living room, sitting up in my room, thinking about you. I'll confess, I'm a mess. Oh. I need to go and run a couple of errands. I was going to do the furniture thing today. But I wasn't looking at no weather. I wasn't looking at no weather. But I don't know. I think I did. I'm trying to think. I think I did take a look. At the gas bill, said I was gonna pay it, which was thirty dollars. But guess what? I had to pay. They just be coming for us, you know. They just be coming for people. It don't make no sense for these companies. They is just, I'm telling you, man, they making a killing off of us. It's ridiculous to charge somebody fifty dollars to turn some service back on. Fifty is six, with well, sixty is what they charge. I had to pay ninety dollars because my bill is thirty dollars, but I don't. I just don't let it slip my mind. I don't know. I'm sitting here trying to play over in my mind like how in the heck. You know how you can just be pacing along, going along, like all my bills paid. I'm caught up, da 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 da, and bam, something hit you like that. Do you know what I could have did with that extra sixty dollars? Like, you know, like do you know? All I'm saying. That's two months worth of McDonald's. But I'm not gonna go there. I'm not gonna go there. I'm not gonna do that, you know. I'm in this healthy train. But I call. I wasn't gonna even call. I just went ahead on and just done the $90. But I did. I did call. Because I was like, you know. I know he just came over here and cut it off. Because I went to go take a shower. And the water is like warm, warm. I mean, if he would. I could see if he. if You know how like if your gas 
get cut off days ago or whatever, then the water gonna be like cold. It's gonna be like cold, like okay, it's gonna be pretty cold. But when the when you just when your gas or what get just get cut off, the water still gonna be pretty pretty warm, which is my situation. Pretty pretty warm. So I hurry up and called, and I was like, you know, he still cause they they did it for me last time. I don't know what her problem is. I done called and got the wrong one. Because I'd done it before. And the lady was like, yeah, he's still in the area. So he can he can just turn it back on for you. Which all they do is sit out there in the truck. She was like, oh, wait, he going to come to the... They don't come to the door over here in the apartments. It's the electronic stuff. They turn their stuff on and off from their truck. So I said, if you would have bought his fine little ass to my door, I would have... It slipped my mind, so I would have just went ahead on and paid it. What they're supposed to do is come to your door. They don't even do that no more. But let them put in those notes when they sit in their truck and type up. Went to the door. Customer did not answer the door. You, you dirty. You dirty. But okay. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? I mean... That sixty dollars, that that was my hard do right there. That sixty dollars, I didn't gave it to the gas company, but that's all right. We gonna, you know how you have to rob Peter to pay Paul and move and go ahead on, you know what I'm saying, and chop it up with Susie. Rob Peter, pay Paul, chop it up with Susie. Like it's gonna get done, okay? It's going to get done. Yeah, but that is over with. Got that out the way. Thank God, and thank God too, that I have gotten to a point where um, I used to just be bad at just using up the available credit that I have on my credit card. I would just, you know, if it's there, I'd be like, use it. But I've got, God, I have gotten better. I won't, I'm not gonna say a lot better, but I have gotten better by paying on it and letting it stay there. Which is why I was able to actually pay this ninety dollars without having to pull my little heart out and be stressed. You know what I'm saying? But I don't even know. I let it slip my mind, but that's it's all good. But yeah. It's not even, but it's just sprinkling outside like a little bit. I'm going to go ahead and get out here in it because I need to do what I do. That has to be done like it's going to be done to do what I need to do today. Sometimes you don't need to be trying to put off until tomorrow. Yes, pro procrastination is my middle name. Yes, it is. I procrastinate. Yes, I do. It gets done though. It gets done. It's it's gonna get done. I'm gonna do it. May not do it when you want me to, but I'm gonna Okay, but yeah, I'm gonna get out here in the streets and I holla rat bit, okay. Oof. Okay. I made it in the car. I didn't melt away, okay? I'm still, I'm still in one piece, you know, but, uh, my thing broke, but I'm still making this vlog thing work. James. Hey, California love. We gonna cut Dr. Dre off because, you know. But the rain is coming down. I'm trying to, let me see. See that rain? See what's going on in my life. You see the money? You can even 
hear it. See? But, uh... Yeah, we... Still gonna do what we do, though. Kids out here, all out here in the rain. I guess the mama said, Get out. They don't want them up in the house. Y'all get your butt outside and play in the rain. Do something. You don't want to take out the trash. You don't want to clean up to get your little bad butt outside. They were all in my breezeway. I was going to call the office because when I said they trashed out, I mean, you know, we don't have those type of problems in my breezeway or whatever where I am of the, uh, my apartments. You know what I'm saying? All that, but they some of them probably don't probably don't even live over here, and then some of them probably stay way in the back. If you want to come way somewhere else, come all up in somebody else's breeway and just trash it out like that. Then they put water bottles all on clipping them to my door. But the office must have got on and said something. Somebody said something because they ain't been back. But, uh, yeah, the rain is coming down, though, and I don't know if it's going to get worse or not, but I just have, like, one place to go. That's another thing. Like I said, this, I know I'm bad, and I'm a procrastinator, but I have really gotten better at, like, dealing with stuff as far as running, handling my business when I need to instead of putting it off. Because I'm glad I have. Because I don't, like I said, I just have one place to go. But, yeah. Holla back, Lara. Hey, hey, that's all I need, baby.